Hi, welcome to Career Aspects TV. Today I would love to give you a tour of our new website 2019. But first, remember to click like, remember to click subscribe, and remember to leave comments below because we would like to know what you think of our new website. So, let's get the intro out of the way and then we can jump straight in. Let's get started on our new website. Now, first off, we tried to design the site to be as simple to navigate as possible and to give you the information you want to know and to give you interactive tools you can use to help with all the things you need to work through when you're doing an application for a university in the UK and all the things you want to know about coming to study in the UK. As I mentioned before the intro, please leave your comments, anything that you would like to see added to the site, um, any new tools you would like to see put in, please let us know. If you think we, you can, we can improve on the navigation of the site, let us know. Comment below. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing we need to do is to get onto the site. www careeraspects.org it's down there okay so you can find it now then right the first thing you have to do is click on the accept cookies and then continue on to the site so we start with the home page now the home page has a bit of information about us, as you can see there if I scroll down, and it has a basic inquiry form where you put your name, your email address, phone number, the course you're interested in, the country that you're applying from, and any additional information. This is a basic information form that you can use. So if you want to put in comments about how we could improve the website or our YouTube channel or anything else you would like to know you can use this basic form okay now when we go across the tabs at the top here next to home we have um, UK universities now the first one down is a list of universities it lists all of the universities that are in the United Kingdom all of them and it is just a list of universities. The second one down is a page that explains to you about pathway and foundation courses which essentially is if you haven't quite got the qualifications or experience necessary to get into university there are courses that you can do that will get you those extra qualifications to get you in and there is a page on pre-sessional courses which essentially is the same type of course so we will just have a quick look at those so if we click on the list of universities it takes you to a nice nice photo across the top of king's college in cambridge uh, which i visited very recently okay so as you scroll down there it is quite simply all the, uh, the universities that are in the United Kingdom. Okay, the next page is the Pathways and Foundation. Uh, again, it's information about uh, pathway courses and foundation courses. And then the last one is the Precessional courses which is the same thing again, it's information about pre-sessional courses. If you would like more information or want to know more about these courses, please come contact us. So if we use the main heading of UK Universities, we get a list of the logos for universities in the UK, and between each row, is an apply now button this takes you to 
our application form. This form will give us all the information we need to make an application on your behalf. So if you fill this form in and submit this form to us, then we can immediately start on an application for you because it will give us all the information we require. This form opens in a second window, so you can close that window and it brings you back to the website. Now, the next button on the headings is Help, Training and Advice. Now I'm going to come back to that one because that's probably the most important one on the website. The next one along is the photo gallery. Now if you click on the main photo gallery, um, that brings you to uh, the smaller collections of photographs. Okay? And you have photos from various things that we've attended, uh, the Chennai Education Fair, uh, people we met at various universities, the University of Law, Anglia Ruskin, Anglia Ruskin London campus. We regularly update this and add photos to us. A very interesting one is if you click on Summer Schools for 2019, you can see a whole selection of photos of all the places we visited with students on our um, summer camp this year. The summer camps really are great fun, as you can see from the photos, the students and the staff uh, have such a great time, they really enjoy themselves, lots of fun, and of course they learn a lot about the UK, our education system, our culture, um, and that helps them with their English language. So, yeah, definitely worth a look. Um, if nothing else, have a look at the gallery for the, um, the summer camps. And if you want more information on the summer camps, of course, um, get in contact with us and we will let you know. We will be adding a page for details for come, uh, summer camps uh, very, very shortly. Okay, the next page, we move on from the photo gallery, we click on the more. If you've got a larger screen uh, computer, then obviously they will show up. Instead of the more button, you will see the next two um, items. Career Aspects TV, where we're talking to you from now. Um, this is uh, essentially, it's all our videos from Career Aspects TV. If you would like... Uh, a video on a particular subject please let us know we'll be happy to try and oblige um, if you would like to advertise on the channel or show your own videos on our channel or you would like us to make videos on your behalf again please feel free to contact us and we will do the best we can to assist you okay the last button is the a partnership button this is for businesses if you are an agent or um, a university or a, an industry or company involved in education then this is where you can find out more about our business opportunities if you would like to work with us and again please contact us and we will be happy to discuss your requirements with you. I'm now going to go back to the uh, tab that I mentioned earlier for help, training and advice because that's the tab that contains uh, a lot of the detailed information and it contains uh, a lot of the help tools that we supply you with, the interactive help tools to help you with the various stages of uh, university application in the UK and visa application. Now, when you click on that tab, it brings you to the main page, and the main page carries the links to the various areas that you will need to look at when you want to apply for a university in the UK. Now, the process can be split into two, and that is your university application and your visa application. So we have a sub-menu at the top here, which I've just opened, um, so that you can work on those two areas specifically. 
There also is a tab for a complete list of all documentation you will need for both processes. So, <clears throat> as we go down, we've got um, the application process with an action plan tool, which helps you plan the whole process of coming to study in the UK, everything from start to finish. You've then got uh, links for your pathway and foundation programs, your pre-sessional courses, your English language tests and requirements, your CV and personal statement. Uh, there are more um, help tools there to help you with preparing a CV and preparing a personal statement. You've then got visa and immigrations. And again, there are work, work tools sorry, in there to help you prepare, prepare, I can't speak English now, to help you prepare for your uh, visa interview and your visa application. And at the bottom, again, is a list of all documentation that you will require for the whole process, both your university application and your visa application. So what we'll do is we'll take a quick look at the various tools that we offer at the moment and we are planning to bring in some more tools for you to use and help make things easier. So application process and action plan. This is a tool designed to help you plan the whole process once you decide you want to come and study in the UK you can use this action plan to make sure that you know everything that you need to do all the information you need to check and find and all the documentation that you need to put together so it's an excellent tool to get you started um, all of these you can submit to us and we will be happy to go through them for you and give you feedback and give you advice on how to proceed. Uh, just going back to the other one now. So the next one that has a tool that you can make use of is CV and personal statement. The personal statement tool is designed to help you write a good personal statement to meet the needs of a university application. Again, you can submit your personal statement to us and we will review it, uh, offer you tips on how to improve it and help you really refine it ready for your application. And the next set of tools is in the visa and immigrations and um, here you've got a whole set of things, documents that you will need preparing for your visa credibility interview so in here <coughs> is you can, again you've got the help, set of help tools you can take um, a written test to assess the quality of your answers that you would give in your verbal test. Once you've completed the written test you can send it in to us for an analysis and we can then if you wish do a verbal test with you to see how well you do with the answers. There are videos here to help you prepare for it and there are videos built into a lot of our help um, worksheets and again there's loads of information here on what you should be thinking about and looking for when you're doing these um, using these tools when you're doing this worksheet so that gives you an overview of the information that the website offers um, as we said we're continually developing tools and improving tools to help make things easier for you to understand and prepare for coming to study in the UK if there's anything you would like to see on the website or there are tools that you think we could develop to help you please let us know contact us through the website contact us through the comments box below 
Um, if you would like to see videos, we will be doing further videos. Um, so that's about it for this video. I hope it's been helpful. I hope you check out our website. And um, we'll see you again soon in our next video. Thank you. Bye.